Right, I did a video on these before, but somehow it got uh, removed. I don't know why, maybe it was a mistake or something, I don't know. But these old uh, shotgun cartridges, uh, French, and I think they're from the late 60s, um, maybe very early 70s. They're a um, rolled, paper cased rolled turnover with a European 7. Very posh for uh, Lepage. Um, if you Google that, that's they make top end um, handbags and stuff now, like 700 quid handbags and stuff. It's very posh, but I can't find a lot on the actual cartridges. I think it used to be some I've street search that address, it's something else now. It's a posh tailor's, but it used to be a department store, uh, a bit like your Harrods, I think, that we've got here in London. But um, yeah, what I'm going to do tomorrow when we go out on the uh, range and I will see look at the condition of them, they're like new but these have been stored well they're over, I'll say they're 50 or even over 50 years, between 50 and 55 years old I would have thought and uh, I'm going to go out and I'm going to uh, put one in the breather and uh, see if we can break some clays with them, see if they go off would you reckon, do you reckon they go off? put it in the uh, in the comments, they haven't got your standard uh, 209 primer, they've got one of them European primers in them. It looks more like a 22 blank than a, than a primer. <laughs> but, uh, I remember them from the old Bakel record cups, which is the old Russian ones. We've got some of them as well. We'll do another video of them, two and a half inch in the old hammer gun. But uh, yeah, I'm going to take these out on the range tomorrow. And uh, we'll do a video and uh, see if we can uh, break some clays with them. They feel quite weighty. So they've got to get they're a game load. They're not a, they're not a clay load, they're a game load, so you're gonna be at least uh an ounce and an eighth in there. I mean, they're heavy they're, they're they're between um oh wait, wait, 30, 32, probably about thirty two gram load in there. Which in old money is an ounce and an eighth. So uh, well, if it's a full box, they're probably worth money and I'm blowing them off. The bloke I bought them off, he's probably looking at this thing, can you tick then, but it's just, it's getting to me, I've got to do it. I want to see what they go like. I've shot old cartridges before, but uh, only old English ones. This is the first time I've got my hands on some uh, vintage French ones. Anyway, next video tomorrow. If you ain't subscribed, subscribe and then you'll see what they, uh, they go like on the range. Thank